Hello again, Huckers. It's Big Country, and we're here for our second part of our MVP Axiom Week, uh, sponsored by Infinite Discs. What I have here, even though it doesn't have a stamp on it, is an MB MVP Vision Photon. This is one of their new ultra long distance drivers. It's got a very thick rim. Normally, I don't throw stuff this fast. But this one only weighs 159 grams, which is actually kind of heavy for this Vision plastic. Uh, it's really grippy, it's sort of gritty. You can kind of see where the air bubbles are, but they don't pop out like Blizzard plastic or VIP air or any of the number, numerous other micro bubble type plastic. This looks like it's going to be a lot more durable. I really don't know what it's going to fly like, so we're going to throw it a couple times here in the field just by itself, and then we'll take it out to the new course in Colorado Springs the Aviary and throw some of its longest holes. After two throws of the Photon Fission, wow, never really thrown a disc like this. It just boomed out there. That first shot was anywhere from four and a quarter to 440. My second one, softer on Heiser, was more like 350, which are huge throws for me. So let's do a few more throws and see what else this thing. Oh yeah, keep rolling. Wow, that's all I can say about the Photon. This thing is a bomber. I love this disc. It, it's already kind of beaten up, so it's a little less durable than regular MVP. We're going to take it out to the aviary, we're going to throw it on our longest hole, and see how well we do. But believe the hype on the Photon. Now we come to the coursework portion with our Fission Photon. Again, I don't really have a disc that I throw that's like this. So I'm going to throw it by itself. First up, we're hole 4, which as the crow flies, about 320 feet. But it's actually a little farther because these crazy elevation changes. And I like to throw a distance driver on this hole because I know it's going to get there. And I've got that nice backstop hill there that I can putt at. So we've got sort of a cross tailwind here. We're gonna throw the old fission photon a little bit out to the right and let the fade do the work. Amen. So our fission photon left us right here, which is an easy chance at a three, pretty much an impossible birdie, at least for me. And that was more user error. This is a really good disc, and I threw with a little too much hyzer and not quite hard enough, and threw it a little offline. If I brought it out farther to the right and just a little more gas on it, I think we would have been okay. We're going to throw one more hole with the Fission Photon, and I'm going to try and throw it right, and then we'll be back with some conclusions. The path is way down there. I think it's around 450 to 500 feet. We've got some nice downhill, and there's a lot of different routes. Normally, I take my VIP Westside Sorcerer to put it on a big Anheuser angle. But we're going to use the Fission Photon, we're going to try and bring it out right, try and miss all these trees, try and not put it in the river, because I'd still like to give this disc away to you guys just how far down the fairway we can get on a nice, healthy rip. Keep in mind, we've got a little bit of a headwind. Might be in the river. Well, unfortunately, 
I wasn't able to keep the vision photon out of the creek. The good news is I'm going to be able to get it so you guys will have a nice fresh photon for the giveaway. So while well, that shot on 18 didn't turn out quite as well as I liked, it did give it a good example of how far this vision photon will go. If you notice, it didn't ever turn all the way over. It actually clipped a tree as it dropped into the creek. If it had missed that tree, it would have kept on going and eventually faded back into the fairway. And it got us most of the way down the fairway. That was a pretty long shot, even hitting the tree and going into the creek. My one big gripe about this Vision Photon is how beat up it's getting already. If you've thrown MVP and Axiom Disc before, which I've been throwing for many years now, you're used to them being extremely durable, especially the overmold. And on the Vision Photon, the flight plate, which is what has the bubbles, which you would think wouldn't be very durable, actually doesn't have a scratch on it. It doesn't even have a scuff. But the overmold itself actually has a huge chunk out of it here, a bunch of scuffs right here, a small chunk here, and a small chunk right here. The edges are really rough and beat up, so that's pretty surprising because MVP, pretty much their overmolds have always been bulletproof. So that would lead me to believe that they've actually lightened up the overmold on these fission discs just a bit, or maybe changed the formula of the plastic. It's still a great disc, and it's a lot more durable than Innova's Blizzard, whatever the heck Discraft calls its bubble stuff, or the last 64 slash dynamic disc slash west side bubble stuff or even the progy bubble stuff basically if you're looking for light high speed drivers i'd say mvp is going to be your best bet from an investment standpoint it's going to cost a little more straight out of the gate but they're going to last a lot longer even with these dings the flight really didn't change that much it's got high glide and it holds the line it's instant distance i love throwing it I love throwing it so much, I almost don't want to give it away. But, Infinite Disc didn't give me this disc to keep. They gave me this disc to give away to you fine folks. But we're going to make you work for it a little bit. So to win this disc here, you need to go to InfiniteDisc.com and write a review for an MVP or an Axiom product. It can be their hats, it can be their shirts, it can be any of their discs. It can even be one of their minis. As long as you write a review. Then take that review link and post it onto this post on the Huckin' Aces Facebook page to enter yourself into winning this Vision Photon. Or of course, if you really want a Vision Photon while you're at Infinite Disc writing that review, just buy one for yourself. It's a great disc and it's well worth your buy. So again, go to InfiniteDisc.com, write a review on an MVP or Axiom product, link that onto this post, and you could win this Vision Photon. So until next time, get out there and knock some discs. It's the music.